Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A woman is speaking on the phone at a train station. B. A group of people is entering a cafe. C. Passengers are boarding a flight. D. A teacher is giving a lecture in a classroom. The correct answer is A. A woman is speaking on the phone at a train station. Number 2. A. A man and woman are working in an office. B. A group of children is playing in a field. C. A man is swimming in the ocean. D. Two people are sitting in a park. The correct answer is A. A man and woman are working in an office. Number 3. A. A group of tourists is exploring a park. B. People are attending a conference in a large office. C. Workers are discussing a project in a conference room. D. Two people are reviewing blueprints outdoors. The correct answer is D. Two people are reviewing blueprints outdoors. Number 4. A. A man is reading a book in a park. B. Several people are jogging along the beach. C. A group of people is attending a business meeting. D. Two people are sitting on a bench in a garden. The correct answer is C. A group of people is attending a business meeting. Number 5. A. A flight attendant is assisting passengers at the gate. B. A group of passengers is waiting to board a plane. C. A man is talking on the phone at an airport terminal. D. People are walking through a shopping mall. The correct answer is C. A man is talking on the phone at an airport terminal. Number 6. A. A man is typing on a laptop at an airport. B. A man is reading a newspaper in a coffee shop. C. A woman is running on a treadmill. D. People are sitting around a table. The correct answer is A. A man is typing on a laptop at an airport. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. How do you usually commute to work? A. By bus. B. In the morning. C. I enjoyed the dinner. The correct answer is A. By bus. Number 2. Do you know where Mr. Smith is? A. He is the project manager. B. He'll be back soon. C. He's in a meeting. The correct answer is C. He's in a meeting. Number 3. Who is giving the presentation tomorrow? A. I'll be attending. B. We need more chairs. C. John will be presenting. The correct answer is C. John will be presenting. Number 4. How was your business trip? A. I'll be leaving next week. B. Very productive. C. I visited Germany. The correct answer is B. Very productive. Number 5. Who is responsible for today's meeting agenda? A. The meeting starts at 2 p.m. B. Yes, I will attend the meeting. C. John created it. The correct answer is C. John created it. Number 6. Who is in charge of the sales department? A. 
It was great. B. Mr. Robinson is. C. I like sales. The correct answer is. B. Mr. Robinson is. Number 7. Is the meeting at 2 p.m.? A. I have another appointment then. B. Yes, I'll be there. C. No, it's been moved to 3 p.m. The correct answer is. C. No, it's been moved to 3 p.m. Number 8. Why are the lights off? A. I'll contact the electrician. B. We have new lights installed. C. The power is out. The correct answer is. C. The power is out. Number 9. Who will lead the meeting today? A. We need more chairs. B. Mr. Thompson will. C. In the conference room. The correct answer is. B. Mr. Thompson will. Number 10. Why did you leave early? A. No, I haven't. B. I had a medical appointment. C. Three miles away. The correct answer is. B. I had a medical appointment. Number 11. Who is responsible for the sales report? A. I have a meeting with him. B. We submit it weekly. C. Jane handles that. The correct answer is. C. Jane handles that. Number 12. Is the meeting room available at 3 p.m.? A. I'll check the schedule. B. Yes, I am free then. C. Let's have lunch together. The correct answer is. A. I'll check the schedule. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening. Conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. Can you cover the customer service desk while I'm at lunch? No problem. I'll be here until 2 p.m. Thanks. I'll be back by 1 p.m. Enjoy your lunch. Until what time will the woman cover the desk? A. 2 p.m. B. 1 p.m. C. 3 p.m. The correct answer is... A. 2 p.m. Number 2. Have you booked the conference room for our client meeting? Yes, I've reserved it for 10 a.m. tomorrow. Perfect. I've also confirmed the client's attendance. Great, let's make sure everything is ready. When is the conference room reserved? A. At 10 a.m. today. B. At 9 a.m. tomorrow. C. At 10 a.m. tomorrow. The correct answer is... C. At 10 a.m. tomorrow. Number 3. Hi, I'd like to book a flight to New York for next Monday. Sure. Would you prefer a morning or evening flight? Morning, please. Okay. I've booked you on the 10 a.m. flight. You will receive a confirmation email shortly. When will the man fly to New York? A. Next Monday at 10 a.m. B. Next Tuesday at 10 a.m. C. Next Monday at 6 p.m. The correct answer is A. Next Monday at 10 a.m. Number 4. I need to book a flight to New York for the client meeting. Do you have a preference for the airline? No preference, just the earliest flight available. I'll check the schedules and book it right away. What is the man's main concern for booking the flight? A. The cost. B. The earliest flight. C. The airline. The correct answer is B. The earliest flight. Number 5. Did you finish updating the project timeline? Yes, I just sent it to your email. Perfect. I'll review it this afternoon. If you have any questions, let me know. When will the man review the updated project timeline? A. 
this afternoon, b, tomorrow, c, this morning. The correct answer is a, this afternoon. Number six. I need some help with the budget report. Sure. What specifically do you need? Could you review the figures and add any missing data? Absolutely. I can get that done by this afternoon. What does the woman need help with? A. Preparing a presentation. B. Scheduling a meeting. C. Reviewing a report. The correct answer is C. Reviewing a report. Number seven. Have you completed the quarterly review? I'm almost done. I just need to finalize the numbers. When will you finish it? I'll have it ready by tomorrow morning. When will the man finish the quarterly review? A. By the end of the day. B. By tonight. C. By tomorrow morning. The correct answer is C. By tomorrow morning. Number eight. I was looking at flights for the Chicago trip. They're quite expensive right now. Did you check the company's travel portal? No, I'll do that next. Thanks for the reminder. Sure, let me know if you need any help. What is the woman trying to do? A. Book flights. B. Book a meeting. C. Check a report. The correct answer is A. Book flights. Number nine. Can you join the team dinner this Friday? Yes, I'm free in the evening. Great. We're thinking of meeting at 7 p.m. Sounds good. Count me in. What time is the team dinner? A. At 6 p.m. B. At 7 p.m. C. At 8 p.m. The correct answer is B. At 7 p.m. Number 10. Can you join the conference call at 10 a.m.? I'm afraid I have another meeting. Can we do it at 11? Sure. I'll send out a new invite. Thank you. When will the conference call take place? A. At 10 a.m. B. At 11 a.m. C. In the afternoon. The correct answer is B. At 11 a.m. Number 11. I need to book a flight to New York for the conference next week. Would you like me to handle the reservations? Yes, please book it for Monday morning. I'll take care of it now. What day is the man flying to New York? A. Monday. B. Tuesday. C. Wednesday. The correct answer is A. Monday. Number 12. Did you finish the expense report for the business trip? Not yet, but I will have it ready by this afternoon. Make sure to include all the receipts. I will, thanks for the reminder. What is the man supposed to include in the expense report? A. Receipts. B. Meeting minutes. C. Hotel reservations. The correct answer is A. Receipts. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. In response to the upcoming heat wave, residents are advised to stay hydrated and avoid outdoor activities during peak temperatures. Public cooling centers will be open from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. daily. Stay safe and check on neighbors who may need assistance during this period. Until what time are the cooling centers open? A. 6 p.m. B. 8 p.m. C. 10 p.m. The correct answer is B. 8 p.m. Number 2. Welcome to the annual charity gala. Tonight's event will feature a silent auction, live music, and dinner. All proceeds will go towards funding our community outreach programs. Thank you for your support. What will the proceeds fund? A. A new building. B. Medical research. C. Community outreach programs. The correct answer is C. Community outreach programs.
Number 3. Welcome to our customer support tutorial. Today we'll show you how to troubleshoot common issues with our software. Please follow along as we go through the guidelines. For more complex issues, you can contact our support team via email. How can customers contact support for complex issues? A. Through live chat. B. Via email. C. By phone. The correct answer is A. Via email. Number 4. Please be aware that the park will be closed for maintenance next Tuesday. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. Regular hours will resume on Wednesday. Why will the park be closed next Tuesday? A. For maintenance. B. For an event. C. For renovations. The correct answer is B. For maintenance. Number 5. The department meeting has been rescheduled to Thursday at 3 p.m. in the main conference room. Please come prepared with updates on your current projects and any questions you might have. Refreshments will be provided, so feel free to bring your coffee mug. What time is the rescheduled department meeting? A. 2 p.m. B. 10 a.m. C. 3 p.m. The correct answer is A. 3 p.m. Number 6. Welcome to our annual Community Health Fair. We have a wide range of activities lined up, including free health screenings, fitness classes and informational booths. Don't forget to visit our blood donation van located near the main entrance. Together, let's promote a healthier lifestyle. What event is being promoted? A. A blood drive. B. A free fitness class. C. Annual Community Health Fair. The correct answer is C. Annual Community Health Fair. Number 7. Our annual charity run will take place this Saturday at Central Park. Registration begins at 7 a.m. and the run starts at 8 a.m. The funds raised will support local educational programs. Participants are encouraged to wear comfortable clothing and bring water bottles. At what time does the charity run start? A. 7 a.m. B. 7.30 a.m. C. 8 a.m. The correct answer is A. 8 a.m. Number 8. The company's annual conference will be held virtually this year due to ongoing health concerns. Attendees can join sessions online, participate in live Q&A, and network via the conference platform. Registration is open until the end of this month. We look forward to an engaging and productive event. Why is the conference being held virtually? A. Health concerns. B. Speaker availability. C. Location issues. The correct answer is A. Health concerns. Number 9. Welcome to our annual charity gala. Tonight, we will raise funds for local animal shelters. Please enjoy the dinner and entertainment we have planned. Don't forget to participate in the silent auction. Your support makes a difference. What is the purpose of the charity gala? A. To enjoy dinner and entertainment. B. To host a silent auction. C. To raise funds for local animal shelters. The correct answer is C. To raise funds for local animal shelters. Number 10. Thank you for joining today's online safety workshop. We will cover the basics of creating strong passwords, identifying phishing scams, and securing your personal information online. If you have any questions, feel free to type them in the chat. What is the primary focus of today's workshop? A. Digital marketing. B. Online safety. C. Basic coding. The correct answer is B. Online safety. Number 11. Greetings, everyone. Our annual marathon will take place next Sunday starting at 7 a.m. sharp. The route will begin at Central Park and end at Riverside Stadium. 
Participants are encouraged to arrive early for a warm-up session. Where does the marathon route begin? A. Central Park B. Riverside Stadium C. City Hall The correct answer is A. Central Park Number 12 Our community center fitness classes are designed to suit all levels. Classes include yoga, Pilates, and high-intensity interval training. Members can book classes online and access our wellness resources. Join us to achieve your fitness goals in a supportive environment. What types of classes are offered at the community center? A. Dance and music B. Yoga and Pilates C. Cooking The correct answer is C. Yoga and Pilates Reading Test In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin! Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, the manager insisted. The importance of teamwork. A, with, B, about, C, to, D, on. The correct answer is D, on. Number two, she insisted. Attending the meeting despite her busy schedule. A, on, B, in, C, to, D, about. The correct answer is A, on. Number three, she regrets. Not studied harder for the exam. A, have, B, had, C, to have, D, not having. The correct answer is D, not having. Number four, the deadline was extended. The client's request. A. Due to. B. For. C. With. D. On. The correct answer is. A. Due to. Number five. He has been working here. Five years. A. Since. B. For. C. In. D. During. The correct answer is B. 4. Number 6. The equipment needs a D before it is used. A. Checking. B. Checked. C. To check. D. To be checked. The correct answer is D. To be checked. Number 7. The results to the client by the end of the day. A. Are sending. B. Will send. C. Must be sent. D. Send. The correct answer is C. Must be sent. Number 8. We must submit the report. The end of the day. A. In. B. On. C. By. D. At. The correct answer is C. By. Number 9. They. The new system when the power went out. A. Tested. B. Are testing. C. Have tested. D. Were testing. The correct answer is D. Were testing. Number 10. His busy schedule, he found time to attend the meeting. A. In spite of. B. Despite. C. Although. D. Because of. The correct answer is. B. Despite. Number 11. She is looking forward. The new project. A. To. B. 
at c 4 d on The correct answer is A. 2. Number 12. They expect a decision soon. A. Making. B. Made. C. Make. D. To make. The correct answer is D. To make. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Dear Mr. Brown, your expense report for last month size has some discrepancies and requires Please visit the Finance Department for clarification. Respectfully, Financial Analyst. A. Reviews. B. Reviewing. C. Review. D. Reviewed. The correct answer is C. Review. Number 2. Dear team, kindly be informed that the office will be closed. The national holiday on July 4th. Have a great day off. Regards, office manager. A. During. B. In. C. For. D. At. The correct answer is A. During. Number 3. The new guidelines are now oxen. In all regions. Please review them at your earliest convenience. A. Effective. B. Effectivity. C. Affecting. D. Effect. The correct answer is A. Effective. Number 4. Dear team, the client meeting has been rescheduled to next Tuesday due to unforeseen. Please adjust your calendars accordingly. Best project manager. A. Circumstances. B. Circumstantially. C. Circumstantial. D. Circumstance. The correct answer is A. Circumstances. Number 5. To all employees, please ensure that all reports are so by the end of the day to avoid any delays in the project. Thank you, project management. A. Submit. B. Submitted. C. Submitting. D. Submission. The correct answer is B. Submitted. Number 6. To all employees. The meeting scheduled for tomorrow has been to next Monday due to unforeseen circumstances. Thank you for your understanding. Best, management. A. Reschedule. B. Rescheduling. C. Reschedules. D. Rescheduled. The correct answer is D. Rescheduled. And finally, Part 7, Reading, Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1, we are happy to introduce our new customer loyalty program, offering significant discounts and exclusive promotions for regular shoppers. You can sign up at the customer service desk or on our website. What is being introduced? A. New store branch. B. Customer loyalty program. C. Flash sale event. The correct answer is B. Customer loyalty program. Number 2. Our upcoming team building event will take place at Lakeside Park on June 12th. All employees are encouraged to attend for a day of fun activities and bonding exercises. Lunch and refreshments will be provided. Lunch and refreshments. What is the date of the team building event? A. July 12th. B. June 12th. C. August 12th. The correct answer is B. June 12th. Number 3. 
Attention passengers, due to extreme weather conditions, flight 123 to New York has been delayed by three hours. The new departure time is 6 p.m. We advise passengers to stay updated for further announcements. We apologize for the inconvenience caused. What is the new departure time for flight 1023? A. 3 p.m. B. 6 p.m. C. 9 p.m. The correct answer is B. 6 p.m. Number 4. To all residents, due to scheduled maintenance, the building's water supply will be temporarily shut off on Saturday, March 12th, from 8 honk a.m. to 2 honk p.m. We apologize for any inconvenience and appreciate your understanding. Sincerely, Building Management. What is the main reason for this notice? A. Scheduled maintenance of the water supply. B. A construction announcement. C. A new policy implementation. The correct answer is A. Scheduled maintenance of the water supply. Number 5. Dear participants, please be informed that the workshop on digital marketing strategies has been rescheduled to Friday, November 25th. We apologize for any inconvenience caused by this change. We look forward to your participation on the new date. Best regards, event organizer. What is the main purpose of this announcement? A. Introduction of a new workshop. B. Rescheduling of a workshop. C. Cancellation of an event. The correct answer is B. Rescheduling of a workshop. Number 6. Attention shoppers. We are holding our annual clearance sale starting next Monday. Expect significant discounts on all items storewide. Don't miss out on these amazing deals. When does the clearance sale begin? A. This Friday. B. Next Monday. C. This Monday. The correct answer is B. Next Monday. Number 7. Our company newsletter for the month of June has just been released. In this issue, you can find updates on recent projects, employee achievements, and upcoming events. Be sure to check your email inbox for the latest news. What kind of information is included in the newsletter? A. Updates on projects, achievements, and events. B. New hire announcements only. C. Monthly financial reports. The correct answer is A. Local community news. Number 8. Attention online, shoppers. Starting next week, online purchases will qualify for free shipping on orders over $50. This new policy aims to provide greater convenience and savings to our customers. Thank you for your continued support. What is the new benefit mentioned? A. Free shipping on orders over $50. B. Expedited shipping for all orders. C. Discount on first purchase. The correct answer is A. Free shipping on orders over $50. Number 9. Notice. The parking lot will be closed for resurfacing from Monday, June 21st until Wednesday, June 23rd. Employees are advised to use alternative parking arrangements during this period. Thank you for your cooperation, operations team. What will happen to the parking lot starting June 21st? A. It will be expanded. B. It will be cleaned. C. It will be closed for resurfacing. The correct answer is C. It will be closed for resurfacing. Number 10. Dear residents, our annual maintenance is scheduled for the first week of March. During this period, there may be temporary disruptions to certain amenities. We appreciate your patience and cooperation. Thank you, Building Management. What is the purpose of the notice? A. To announce new amenities. B. To request residents' feedback. C. To inform about scheduled maintenance. The correct answer is C. 
to inform about scheduled maintenance. Number 11. Dear students, the library will be closed this weekend for renovation work. Please ensure to borrow or return any books by Friday evening. The library will resume normal operations on Monday. Thank you for your understanding. Library management. What is the main purpose of this message? A. To inform about the library's temporary closure. B. To announce new library hours. C. To advertise a new book. The correct answer is A. To inform about the library's temporary closure. Number 12. Starting next Monday, the office will have new operating hours. Monday to Friday from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. This change aims to provide better service to our clients. What is changing about the office's operating hours? A. They will start at 8 a.m. and end at 6 p.m. B. They will start at 9 a.m. and end at 5 p.m. C. They will remain the same. The correct answer is A. They will start at 8 a.m. and end at 6 p.m. Number 13. Dear employees, please be reminded that the deadline for submitting your quarterly performance reviews is next Friday. Timely submissions help us ensure accurate evaluations and planning for the next quarter. Late submissions may impact your performance grading. When is the deadline for submitting the performance reviews? A. End of the month. B. Next Friday. C. Next Monday. The correct answer is B. End of the week. Number 14. Effective from next month, the office working hours will shift to 9 a.m. 6 p.m. to better accommodate our clients' needs. All departments are expected to adhere to the new timetable. We appreciate your understanding and cooperation in this adjustment period. What is changing? A. Office working hours. B. Office locations. C. Employee benefits. The correct answer is A. Office working hours. Number 15. We're excited to introduce our new loyalty program, designed to reward our most valued customers. Members will receive exclusive discounts, early access to new products, and points for every purchase that can be redeemed for future discounts. Sign up today to start enjoying these benefits. What is the main topic of this announcement? A. New store location. B. Loyalty program introduction. C. Product recall. The correct answer is B. Loyalty Program Introduction Number 16. Dear employees, please be reminded that our annual team-building retreat will take place from October 5th to 7th. This event is mandatory, and participation is crucial for fostering teamwork and collaboration. Ensure to mark your calendars and plan accordingly. What is the purpose of this reminder? A. Informing about a team-building retreat. B. Announcing a holiday party. C. Scheduling a meeting. The correct answer is A. Informing about a team building retreat. Number 17. Dear customers, to improve our services, we will be conducting a survey from November 1st to November 15th. Your feedback is valuable to us, and participants will receive a 10% discount on their next purchase. Please check your email for the survey link. Thank you for your time and support. What is the incentive for participating in the survey? A. Entry into a raffle. B. Free product samples. C. 10% discount on next purchase. The correct answer is C. Priority customer service access. Number 18. Dear members, to enhance your experience, our gym will introduce new fitness classes starting next month. Check the schedule on our website for more details. We hope you enjoy these new additions. Best regards, the Fitness Club. What is being introduced at the gym? A. New equipment. B. Extended hours. C. New fitness classes.
The correct answer is C. New fitness classes.